Hi everyone, my name is Anna Lee, and today I'm reviewing this Flynn Rider doll by the Disney Store. He is the 2014 version and he was retailing for about $17 at Disney Store. Ok, so the start with the reveal is a closer look at his face and I'm not very happy with this Flynn Rider doll because I think he's not very movie accurate. I mean, I still look at him and I know that he's Flynn Rider, but I don't know, I think he could be a little bit different and he could look a little bit more movie accurate. So I'm not really sure about his face, but I still kind of like it. The hair of this doll is of course sculpted and I don't like his hair that much either because it doesn't have that much detail. Here on the front he has this kind of styling that is very movie accurate I guess, but in the back he's just a piece of plastic which has no detail and I don't like that. The outfit of this doll is the same that he wears in the movie and I really like it because it's a kind of like a simplified version but I still really like it because he has this kind of long sleeved shirt and it's a very nice material. Then he has this vest which is kind of like a teal color and it's a very kind of soft material so I really like it. Then he has this belt with a little piece of material here and that's a detail that I don't like because it's supposed to be his satchel but it's just a piece of material and that's kind of sad but that's okay, I like it. And his pants are these brown color pants and they are not really detailed at all but I think they are good, I mean they work perfectly with his outfit and as a whole I think it looks very movie accurate and very very nice. And as for his shoes he has these little dark brown boots and I really like them because they look very movie accurate and the detail it's not maybe super outstanding but I think it's great and they look very very nice and I believe they are the same boots that the John Smith doll wears. Articulation wise he comes with rotation in the head, movement in the arm and elbow. And in the legs he kind of has rubber click knees but the only movement that he has is this simple band which is basically nothing and it's very hard to see but that's all that he has. And here's a high comparison with Rapunzel, and as you can see, he's slightly taller than her. Okay, so I think that was it. I will give this all an 8 out of 10 because I think that his face could be way more movie accurate. He could have a lot more detail on his hair, and his clothes are not bad, but I think they are improvable. So I do recommend it to get him, and that's my review. Thanks for watching. Bye.